Brainwashing, sex abuse, and even branding. Those are just some of the horrors that former members of the Nexium cult lived through. And today, they finally got some sense of closure. The leader of the cult, Keith Raniere, will spend the rest of his life behind bars. CBS 2's Lisa Rosner is live outside Brooklyn Federal Court with breaking news on this sentencing. Lisa. That's right, Dana. Ranieri got 120 years, and as you said, that means he will serve life in prison. The 60-year-old was convicted of multiple crimes, including sex trafficking and racketeering. For hours, the court heard statements from 15 of Keith Ranieri's victims detailing years of emotional and sexual abuse after becoming a part of Nexium, which Ranieri started. Several women, including a 15 year old girl, were groomed to have sex with him and even branded with Ranieri's initials. Barbara Boucher was the first to leave in 2009. It's been 20 years of my life, and, and a lot of it's very traumatic. So, you know, post traumatic stress like wears on you, and it's very debilitating, you know. so. My body is not a happy camper, but my mind is clear, my heart is solid, my spirit is good. Founded in Albany in 1998, Nexium offered self-help courses through its executive success programs, eventually opening centers across North America. The U.S. attorney said Ranieri trafficked one victim from Mexico and confined her to a room for nearly two years. It is our sincere hope that today's sentence does deliver some measure of justice uh, for those victims who suffered in uh, immeasurable uh, and, and numerous ways. Ranieri's lawyer asked for a 20 year sentence. Ranieri said before sentencing he had no remorse for the crimes because he didn't commit them, saying in part, I do believe strongly that I'm innocent of the charges, but it is also true I see all this pain. And Seagram's hair, Claire Bronfman also had a role in the organization. She was sentenced to nearly seven years in prison last month. And actress Allison Mack awaits sentencing for racketeering. But again, Keith Ranieri sentenced to 120 years in prison. We're live outside Brooklyn Federal Court. Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News. Lisa, thank you.